Next thing you need is a three quarter inch piece of PVC pipe. And this is gonna slide over the top of this. And this piece is about four and a half inches long. So this goes over. Wants to stop on this little thing right here, make sure it goes all the way down. Okay, all the way down to there. It won't go further than this green though. Now this is an important part. You need a little masonite board. This is a, a wood board. Uh, I rec recommend this over cardboard because the cardboard can, um, can actually kind of bend and, and break on you. So you need to use what's called a Forstner bit to cut out the center here. Um, it's a 7 eighths bit and it fits on a screwdriver. And then it just cuts a hole in the center and then you can place this right over the top. And then the last thing, this is a PVC pipe uh, cap. It's a screw cap. And you want to screw this on so that this is super tight, super duper 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 tight. As tight as you can get it so that this board doesn't move. Okay, so see it's not moving. Okay, so just like that. This cardboard is actually gonna sit over the top like this. Our golf ball will sit over this and then the tease usually comes up. It's a little bit bigger. I'm gonna put some fondant on there and fix that up. Um, but for this, this cake needs to actually sit over this a little bit. So what I'll do is flip this over Take this, because this is gonna sit right about here. And then I will just use, you know, you can use a knife or a spatula here. And I just wanna cut a little bit of this cake out. Now you can put foil over this if you want so to protect that so that you don't, um, get, you know, the plastic isn't on your cake or anything. And we'll just put a little bit of buttercream here. And we're just gonna test it right now before we ice it, because it's easier. And it will sit right on there, and then, then that'll help you stay. Now, if you're gonna transport this, you can actually have a longer piece that goes up further and even through this board, uh, which would be a lot safer if you're gonna be transporting it um, a little bit of a distance. So keep that in mind. Okay, now what I want to do is ice this. And sometimes it's actually easier just to ice it up there. So I am just gonna take some buttercream, stir it up a little bit, ice it, and then I wanted to make sure this is chilled. So I'll probably pop this in the freezer until it's completely chilled, because it'll be easier to ice. I mean, easier to ice, easier to cover. I'm icing it right now, hello. All right, let me turn it so you can see. Make sure you get all the way down to where that cardboard was under there. So I just like to put a lot on and then I'll end up taking some off when I go to smooth it, which is gonna be my next step. So I'm gonna use this piece of acetate, which is a clear paper. And I am gonna take this and cup it, my hands like this, start from the bottom and then just lightly come up and over, wipe that off, then go next to it, up, over. Sometimes I'll go in different directions when I see that I need to fill a little hole in or something like that. Make sure you get under there though. Okay, so there's this part here, see where it goes in? That's where the cake's connected there. I need to make sure I build enough icing there that I don't see that. It was there and I think one more spot like right here. Okay, I am actually gonna cut this down in half because I have a little bit more control now for smaller areas. And I almost wanna just come around this way Try to keep that area round. Okay, so once I get to about this stage, then I wanna go ahead and pop this. I'm gonna pop it in the freezer. If you're not going to um, ice it for a little while or cover it and find it for like a day or something, you know, maybe in the morning tomorrow or something, you could just put it in the refrigerator. 
but I'm going to be covering probably like 10 to 15 minutes. So I want to go ahead and pop it in the freezer. Place it on another board. You may have to touch it up a little bit just from touching it. You know, I didn't want it, don't want it falling over, rolling around on the floor, right? <laughs> Into the freezer we go.